up, bring the key up. Shake that thing up at that sand in the cheetah. K face with a 38. Yeah, my bro, man, listen, I, and, I, and I always say this because people be asking me, what's up at Lefty? Ooh, ooh, ooh. he the best Mexican rapper. I said, he ain't the best Mexican rapper, bro. He one of the best rappers we got in the city. Yeah, wow. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You don't even got to put no race on it because bro got his skill level was there. No, I said brand new AP NHD. I'm gang banging in Hellcats and SRT. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gon' talk. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Even if you got a security, you don't feel right because mm -hmm. you, you ain't clutching on your own shit. Like, you know, you don't trust I, nobody the way you do. You trust yourself. Have them security. Bro. They they trying to make it home. I yeah, had my lately, boy. Lately, lately, I've been on some, like, spiritual shit, like some godly shit. Like, nah, God wrote the script already. God already wrote the script. God already knows when he dies, I die, you die. God already wrote the script. Why am I going to be... Nah, I just, I just go with the flow and that's it. When it's my time, it's my time. I'm telling you, like, like I interviewed this guy named Kenny B down in, in Texas. Texas popping, and, he's popping. Yeah, yeah, he doing his thing. He about to, he about to do four years though. He took the time. But but he he That's told a me long time. He told me something though. He said that he didn't want the security. To, he didn't really, you know, he wanted his brother's homeboys because he said the security gonna go by the law. Yeah, they gonna try to. They not gonna shoot when he want. Yeah, he want them to shoot like fast. Yeah, I got my. I said what? You know, we know security Bro, game though. Like we don't stuff. do security like. Like I know, I know the um, pros and cons of that shit. Like I know the uh, consequences, but it's, it's just like I don't do security. See what I'm saying? Cause it's like I pay you to protect me, and you don't know me. See what I'm saying? Like it can be anything. Like when I'm ready to shoot, I'm ready to shoot. I don't want you to um, go by the law. I don't want you to wait for the right time and all that shit. Like just well, shoot him. Like see what I'm saying? I don't want to do nothing. So when I'm ready to do it, I'm ready to do it. I don't want like I trust my partners and my cousins more than security. See what I'm saying? Like you might get paid to backdoor me. Yeah, like, yeah. Mom, yeah, cause it's, it's you, you don't you, trust them. No, your life, your life could split decision like that. Your life could change like that. Mm -hmm. Positive, good way, anything. You know what I'm saying? Like you might have somebody trying to up his points. I don't know. Whatever, whatever, whatever the case may be. Just. It's, it's, it's a deadly game out here when when you gang banging and you dissing and you out here doing shows and shit like you really gotta be I trust my homie Cash he, he's with me all the time. he's from my hood and he's my manager I trust him cause he knows he knows me and he's tapped in with my homeboys and like he just tells me what's right I hate that shit though I I hate I hate all that that stuff for the but it is what it is it's cool I love it I love being on stage I love entertaining I love fucking the crowd I had a show last night I was telling them I had a show in Riverside that's just sold out I walked into the bag huh Cash. Like all the fans, I walked in with all of them. They're like, "What the fuck, Lefty, Lefty, man? What's up?" I take a picture with everybody. Yeah, I show love too. Go, yeah, I show love to my fans, man. I make it rain on the street for Nikia. Shake that thing up at that sand in the cheetah. K face with a thirty eight. Yeah, that was my fans. bro, man. Listen, I, and, I, and I always say this because people be asking me, "What's up at Lefty? Ooh, ooh, ooh. he the best Mexican rapper." I said, "He ain't the best Mexican rapper, bro. He one of the best rappers we got in the city." Yeah, wow. you know what I'm saying yeah. you don't even got to put no race on it because bro got his skill level was there. No, I said brand new AP NHD. I'm gang banging in Hellcats and SRT. Yeah, yeah, with everybody and shit like that. You yeah, know what I mean, yeah. yeah, I got some. I got songs coming up with TZ. TC, shout out to TZ, yeah, killing it. TC4800. Shout out to TC. Yeah, yeah TC4800. shout out. Hopefully, Mitchy Slick, I'm going to holler at him when I when bounce Yeah, out. you got to do it with Slick, man. <laughs> you got to do it with Slick. For sure, for yeah. sure. Yeah, Slick, yeah. he said he got me. That's hard, you know man. Said, yeah, he got like, me. Like, how do you, what's your process? Like, LA bro? today go. Roll bounce on my face like my name was Draco. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> What's your process, yeah. man, when you get to that studio, man? When I get to the studio, I hate the studio. I'm in and I'm out. I'm working. I don't like to kick it there. Um, I don't like people that are in the room that are fucking with me or girls in the room that are just messing me up. And I just see it in my mind the way my mind is sick. I see where I want to drop at the way I want it. If it's not right, if it's good, I don't want it. It's got to be the best. You know what I'm saying? And I, I, I don't do no features with nobody that, that I don't think, not even the 7,000, 5,000 for the features. Cool, but it's like it's not worth it to me because... That dude has my song forever. I want all my stuff to be like, you know, bangers. I'm just really serious about my music. That's a good way of thinking. Yeah, I go in there. I go in there. I, go, I freestyle a lot, but when they let me write it, I write it. But it's really very hard to write a song and get in the zone and write something that the streets are going to feel to. You know what I'm saying? It, it doesn't happen. I'm running out of all my composition. No, no pass from prison. I already ran through them, so now I got to write new content. How much did you write in prison? I'm almost all my songs. Almost all my songs. How I, many? I wrote a lot in prison. Prison's probably where I wrote the most music at. It's just at to like just my my head a melody in my head or just something on the radio you know and i came out home and i wrote man probably a whole album in there yeah 
Or album in there. So you knew you you, you was determined when you get out yeah, here, I'm gonna make this music work. Yeah, yeah. This time I said I manifested it. I said I'm gonna come home, I'm gonna be a rapper, and that's that. That's all. Fuck what everybody said. And then I said them two steps back, like Nip said. Then two steps back to take ten forward were the ones that hurt the most, cause the hoods looking at you like, what the fuck? He's a fucking rapper. You know, he a rapper and a just a uh, you got to sacrifice and a not sell dope no more because you're selling dope down the block you really got to be rap 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 and that's it and it really works out and then your mom's gonna tell you man it ain't working out like you're gonna struggle you're gonna you're gonna go broke you're gonna you're gonna be struggling for, even for i remember struggling for a white team now i got a gang of pro club shit like i remember struggling to buy shoes i got money in my pocket now i got chains on my neck like that's cool it really works out but it, it's a sacrifice into it working out it doesn't just happen overnight it, it i'm gonna be a rapper everybody wants to be a rapper you know what i'm saying it don't work that way. You gotta, you gotta put in the work, man. You gotta put in the work. You really gotta be serious about it. And I was really serious about it, and that's why they vibe with it. What surprised you the most, though, with when it come down to like people that's on the next level, the industry uh, cats, you know, the ones who was receptive to your music or not receptive to it? Oh well, there's a lot of them that I reached out to, and uh, they try to hit me up now, and I'm like, fuck you. Yep, you got know? to. Like, fool, you remember that shit when I hit you? Look at me now, dog. Hell no. Nah. Some dude, some want to do a video of me. I said I want him recording me. I remember I wrote this fool when I first started. Fuck him. I'm wow. a gang. Now I'm popping. Now look at look now. And then they'd be like, man, it's cool. And uh, uh, Solis, I had wrote him, like, I'm going to sign World Chart, da, 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 da. Just stuff like that. Like, uh, uh, a lot of people just, yeah, I, I, that's how it is. For every rapper, they're probably, I was dying to get an interview. And I was just like, my schedule's already packed already to like <laughs> April, May. It's like, it's already packed. So once you're hot, you're hot. Yeah. And I don't ever want to go cold. People like, I was talking to Lil Weirdo. Me and Weirdo, were, talk, Weirdo. Yeah, me, me and Weirdo were talking and Weirdo calls me and he's like, Hey man, I'm like, what's up? He's all like, you high right now, boy? And I'm like, yeah, he goes, enjoy the moment. Fuck as many bitches as you can and, and, and just enjoy the moment, dog. You know what I'm saying? What the fuck does that mean? Like, you know what I'm saying? Because I don't ever want this shit to stop. You know what I'm saying? It's a lot of work. I be tired. I'm always working, but I don't ever want it to stop. And it's true, though. When you're hot, you're hot. When Draco was hot, I think Draco was always hot. Yeah. When Weirdo was hot, he was hot. Yeah, Draco, Draco had a, since he started, he had a wave. But when YG was hot, YG was hot. Still hot. But when YG was hot, yeah, he when was he first hot. came out, yeah, 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 he was hot. Then too, it wasn't no, it wasn't no competition in LA. Like young guys, yeah. bro was like one of the first people that got signed. Yeah, that I that I knew, I was like, damn, he got a deal. Yeah, yeah, I remember. Mm -hmm. Wasn't nobody about getting that, deals about. Yeah. Wasn't nobody yeah. getting no deals. Yeah. I always say this because people be asking me, "What's up at Lefty? Ooh, ooh, he the best Mexican rapper. So he ain't the best Mexican rapper, bro. He one of the best rappers we got in the city. Yeah, wow. you know what I'm saying yeah. you don't even gotta put no race on it because bro got his skill level was there. Look, I said brand new AP NHD. I'm gang banging in Hellcats and SRT. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk.